Computer Science Vocabulary for Third Graders. Today, we're diving into some exciting computer science words that will help us understand how technology works. Our first word is abstraction. Making something simpler by focusing on main parts and leaving out extra details. When you play a game, you press a button and a character moves. You don't need to know all the code behind that movement. You just know pressing the button makes it happen. Abstraction in coding is about focusing on what we need to use and not on every detail of how it works. An algorithm is a set of steps to solve a problem or complete a task, like in a recipe. Binary is a counting system that uses only zeros and ones. A loop is doing something over and over until a certain condition is met. Debug means finding and fixing mistakes in a program. Condition. A condition is a rule that lets a program decide between options, often using if statements, like if it's sunny outside, then play outside. An event is an action that makes something happen in a program. A variable is a placeholder in code that can hold different values like a name or number. For example, if you have a variable called score, it can hold different numbers as you play a game. At the beginning, score might be zero, but each time you win points, the number in the score box changes. Variables help programs keep track of important information that can change while the program runs. A sequence would be steps or actions in a specific order. Decomposition means breaking down a big problem into smaller parts to make it easier to solve. In coding, decomposition means breaking a big problem into smaller, easier steps. For example, in a game, you might write separate code for moving a character, jumping, and collecting coins. Each small part is simpler to code and together, they make the whole game work. A prototype is a simple model created to test an idea before making the final version. Input is information or instructions given to a computer to help it run. So let's practice. Now that we know some awesome computer science words, let's practice them together. Accounting system that uses only zeros and ones. Is that loop? binary or abstraction? The answer is binary. Finding and fixing mistakes in a program. Is that prototype, debug, or input? The answer is debug. A placement holder in code that can hold different values like a name or number. Is that variable, sequence, or decomposition? The answer is variable. Breaking down a big problem into smaller parts to make it easier to solve. Is that variable, abstraction, or decomposition? The answer is decomposition. Doing something over and over until a certain condition is met. Is that condition, loop, or binary? The answer is loop. Making something simpler by focusing on main parts and leaving out extra details. Is that abstraction, event, or algorithm? The answer is abstraction. A simple model created to test an idea before making the final version. Is that binary, prototype, or variable? The answer is prototype. Information or instructions given to a computer to help it run. Is that input, abstraction, or loop? The answer is input. A set of steps to solve a problem or complete a task like a recipe. Is that sequence, prototype, or algorithm? Answer is algorithm. An action that makes something happen in a program. Is that event? binary, or decomposition? The answer is event. A series of steps that happen in a specific order. Is that abstraction, loop, or sequence? 
The answer is sequence. A rule that lets a program decide between options, often using if statements. Is that a condition, input, or an event? The answer is condition. Great job exploring these computer science terms. Now you know some important words that help us understand and work with technology. Remember to practice these words as you continue your journey in computer science.